In this video, we will show how to replace the LED strips in this Sony 60 inch TV. Begin by removing the screws and the back cover off the TV. Before lifting the back cover completely, there is a cable that is connected to the back cover and also connects to the chassis. Be sure to carefully disconnect that first. Next, disconnect the ribbon cables. Remove all the screws around the TV that hold the bezel to the chassis. Remove the bezel from the chassis. Remove the screws and the buffer board covers. Release the buffer boards from the tabs that hold them in place. Flip up the buffer boards and tape them to the TV panel. Lift the TV panel and remove it from the chassis. Remove the filter frame around the entire TV. You can do this using your fingers releasing the filter frame from the tabs. You can also use a small tool that might help remove it as well. Hold the layers of diffusion in place and then wrap the corners with some tape to hold them together and in the correct order. This will help when you put them back onto the TV. Lift and remove the layers of diffusion. While we are replacing these LED strips, we are going to cut out the paper that is on top of them. We have found that this is an easier process and better for saving the reflector sheet for the rest of the TV ch TV's chassis. You will need to remove the white pins that are holding the LED strips to the chassis. On this end, there, there is a cable connection that will need to be disconnected before you can remove the LED strips from the chassis. Simply pull it out to remove it. Then remove the LED strips from the chassis. We recommend using double sided tape to help hold the reflector sheet to the chassis and also the LED strips in place after you have installed the replacement ones. You will not need to use the little white tabs to hold the LED strips to the chassis if you use double sided tape. Align the replacement LED strips into position on the chassis and the double sided tape. Then firmly press them on top of the double sided tape.
reconnect the power cable to the LED strips. Reinstall the layers of diffusion and remove the tape in the corners. Then reinstall the filter frame around the entire TV. Reinstall the TV panel. This is optional, but it may help to hold these ribbons in place around the TV by just simply putting some painter's tape on them and attaching them to the filter frame. Slide the buffer boards back into the tabs that hold them in place. Reinstall the buffer board covers. Install the screws to secure the covers to the chassis. Reinstall the bezel. Install the screws that hold the bezel to the chassis. Reconnect the ribbon cables. Reconnect the cable underneath the back cover. Then align the back cover and install the screws to secure the back cover 